So there we go. This is uh, this is my piece of Nova Scotia. Check the view. That's from the side here. Now we're gonna pan over. Like, you see that taller tree that's in the right behind the barn? You could see there. That's pretty much the marking on my property. And that's the house. Right on the other side of the house, there's a uh, there's a little ditch, we'll say. And uh, that's it's a draining ditch that goes from that other side of the street. Okay. <coughs> Oops, sorry. So there you go. Yeah, there's it's Highway 201, which is like a tertiary highway. So you got the the mansion for the 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 animals that to be and uh, my partial garage. Got the the little house. Oh my god, is it ever nice. So before I go inside, what I'm going to go is I'm going to go in the on the back deck. So yeah, a lot of windows. A lot of windows. <laughs> well, it's all bear approved. Right, bear? Right, buddy? Yes. So, there you go. So, we have the back deck, which is not a huge deck, but it's, it's a fun deck because it's multi-level. That's the entrance to the basement, which is like a dungeon, so... There used to be an oil tank here, and we got it removed because we do not want that oil tank here. So there you go. So this is the deck. The main deck. And you got the under the under the tree sitting area so that you can enjoy. And Kelly says, yep, this is where I'm going to get buried in 20, 30, 40, 50 years. So, yeah. Check out that. Like I said, see where that tall tree is in the background there? That's pretty much our demarcation-ish. And there's a ditch right down here behind the hostas. And it runs all the way. And, uh, that's our line. It goes all the way to the river. You see the river in the background down there? And you see the river, just let me zoom in here, the river behind the tent there, it goes all the way there, yeah, that's us, <laughs> I can't believe this, this is crazy, and we got all kinds of cute little birds, last night we were enjoying our, our supper, and, uh, the uh, hummingbirds were coming. They were humming. And you get, you, like every country road, there's idiots that takes, you know, 80 kilometer hour, uh, that, oh, it's a drag race. But our, our bedroom is actually on this side of the window. I couldn't hear any of those goombas. So there you go. So you got the back side here. So I'm just going to cut this off now and we're going to go towards the, actually the barn. Anyway, barn's a barn. Inside there's a, on this side of the barn, there's a garage type area, all cemented. The other one is going to be fully dirt floor-ish. And uh, we're going to put the animals on that side. So I'm going to just cut and then we're going to go in at the uh, inside the house. Hello. Good morning. Waiting for this car to drive by. Yeah. Good morning. Welcome to Carlton Corner. We are finally here. We just spent our first night in the house and had a good night's sleep. Woke up to an overcast and a fine soft day, as my grandfather would call it. This is the dooryard. It's the driveway. This is, will be the door the that everybody uses. Okay. The bear. The bear. 
So this will be the sewing room. Yeah. So what we envisioned for the sewing room is... My ironing board will go across here. Yep. So that I have this view. And my work table will go here. So I have this view. Get to see Lacey in the barn. Yep. Get to see if anybody's at the door. And that way if uh, com people come for fittings and whatnot, they come to the side door. Yeah, they come to the side door. Everybody comes to the side door. The front door is just for show. We are in the Maritimes. Welcome to the kitchen. Check out that beast. Check out that beast. I have to figure it out and clean it and all that good stuff because the inside is all sooty. This will be the kitchen table area where grandma's kitchen set will go. Hutch will go in that corner. That table corner and chairs. Right there. Table and chairs. And when this is gone, the buffet will go here. Yeah, this little cupboard right there, that's uh, going to leave soonish. And we'll put a buffet there. Yeah. Coolio. I have a laundry room and a half bath over here. See, and it's fully functional. Yeah, and that washer and dryer is freaking amazing. We and a galley kitchen. Galley kitchen. Which is remarkably well laid out for being so small. So we have dishwasher, double sink, counter space, stove. The reason why the cat food's up there is because Duff yesterday hid in that corner right there most of the day. He only came out of there last night when everybody else was gone and we were in bed. Anyway, fridge, one of the fridge. And on the other side, we have more counter space, which we have to make coffee because we haven't had, we had haven't coffee, coffee yet. We're not. And Jenny and JR brought us breakfast. And, and groceries. And food. down there is the hatch to go into the dungeon, uh, the basement, which is kind of a dungeon. But it's so down there, believe it or not, there's a larger than. Well, actually, if you look at this cabinet, you want to stand in front of that cabinet. If you look at that cabinet right there, there's a freezer that's about that size. An upright. <laughs> An upright freezer that is about that size, down in the basement. Plus a fridge. And a coffin freezer. And a coffin freezer. <laughs> it's also bigger than me. And, oh yeah, and in the barn there's another fridge. Yes. And there's a fridge and a freezer and a stove and a bar fridge <clears throat> in the truck coming from Montreal. We have a plethora of fridges. Holidays are going to be hilarious. So this here is... This will be the dining room. Yeah, I'm going to go over here. With, with <clears> the <throat> built-ins in it. The dining room with the built-ins. And, and I'm going to open the door. And you're going to show... Oh, yes. And show that I have already started to unpack things and throw away boxes. <laughs> Oop, it went fuzzy on me. It's too dark in here. Let's turn some light on. Turn some light on. <clears throat> oh. So that will be the dining room where we're going to be able to put our big freaking big table. The dining room table will go here. <clears throat> which was used and as probably, a cutting table downstairs in the basement. Probably the china cupboard will go here. China cupboard right there. And then bookshelves. And on this side will be bookshelf, 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 bookshelf. Bookshelf, because I am married to a PhD candidate. And the loom will go over here somewhere. And in the, the loom will be built and be part of the furniture over here. I think there's yeah. enough head space for her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, see, the, this is a, one of those things. Like, Kelly's only 5'3", okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm only 5'3", and uh, I can touch the ceiling. That's okay, though. The old radio is going to go here. The old radio that was in our living room will go right there. Perfect and it, spot. And it's going to have speakers in it that are going to be hooked up to the computer so that we can play jazz and blues and 
Muzak. This will be the living room, living room. So there's transitions and the carpet ends at each transition, right? Yep. Cool. Because our plan is to remove the carpet. Yeah. Especially and in this room, really yeah. quick, so that our rug can go down. Yeah. I noticed that there's no cable in this room. No cable outlet. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, you, you, the, uh, our old house may have two outlets per room. This one here, there won't be an extension cord anywhere. There's so many freaking outlets. Yeah, they're everywhere. There's on uh, almost every wall. Some of them are in precarious areas, you know, like over there. Oh, there's well, that it vacuum. Meant, it meant something for somebody. If... Yeah. And but there's some like you look over here. That's cable, phone, and Ethernet ready. And then this one. And this one here. here for an 1857 house, you know, I'm liking it. This one here has USB ports in it. So is that one. <laughs> okay, so let's carry on in this room. In this room. So this is not the living room. The living room. And this is the foyer right there. You want to turn on the light in the foyer? Yeah. That way we... Won't go fuzzy. It won't go fuzzy on me. It won't go fuzzy on me. Won't go fuzzy on us. This beautiful door. It's locked here for me right now. Yeah. You got to push on it. There you go. I know. I'm not strong enough. Gonna push and turn. It's a handle. You know. I did. I did turn. Okay. So yes, it's a great door. We need to have a. Uh, a sign. A plaque. We. Oui. Something. Something that says, but it's you know. It's a beautiful color of red. Yeah, because it's. It's exactly I think it's, the same color that I would paint it. It's the same color we painted the. Uh, the the one in, in, Claremont the, in Claremont Street. Like a raspberry it's red. Beautiful windows. But this one will always be locked. Yeah. Yep. That one. Obviously, I can't open it. Well, there's a skeleton key to lock this. Yeah. Somewhere. I think it's in a Ziploc baggie in the kitchen. But this works just as well. Yep. And screen door locks too. Okay. Yep. So there you go. All right. So and we got a lock, a, a, a nice clock. It needs a battery. Yeah. It's not really a 9:24 right now. Yeah. So here. This is the den. Which is dark right now. Which is dark. Down right there. Now, Push on it. There you go. There's Duff. There's Duff. Hey, he buddy. His meow again. Yeah. So this will be the computer room. This will be the computer office. Game room. Game room. We'll figure it out. Yeah. But yeah, there's going to be three desks in here. So probably one over there, one over here, and one in here. Yep. And all of these frilly lace curtains are going. And uh, that would take you back to the kitchen through the, the dining, room. dining room. Right there. See, you got these little, little doors. Little French doers. That way I don't hear the washing washing machine. machine. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. And the Harry Potter uh, closet. Literally, the Harry Potter closet. Which will be the Kelly Red, uh, Ready Use Mag. The Ready Use Magazine. Okay, now check out these steps. Like they're normal. Yeah. They're, little, they're a little high. They're a little high. I'm not sure they're code. 
Especially not the one at the top. They're definitely not the code. Yeah, they're... But anyway, so we'll start over here. Spare bedroom. This is the spare bedroom. So if you come to visit, as long as you tell us ahead of time, this will be your area. Once we've unpacked. Yeah, don't come yesterday or today or this weekend. Or Monday. Because we don't know when this stuff is arriving. We'll stick to the left, just like a good Dungeon Dragon maze. So this is the beautiful big hallway. Yeah, it is a quite the hallway upstairs. Lacey has a beautiful uh, secretary desk that's going to go on this wall. Bueno, there's the the ginormous bathroom. Yeah. I've had apartments bigger than this bathroom. They're <laughs> smaller than this apartment, or this bathroom rather. Yeah, so you got the, you know, the standard tub shower thing there. Yeah, and beautiful deep tub. I had a bath last night. And uh, the wallpaper is going to go in this room. You don't like the wallpaper? No, no, no it kind of screams 1980s, <laughs> as does the cheap melamine furniture. Yeah, the, There's uh, multitudinous dressers in this house, so I think a dresser's going to go here. And this will be Lacey's, Lacey's room. This will be Lacey's room. She's will gonna... be because uh, we have some renovations to do. Yes, this, this closet was an afterthought of a closet. Not deep enough for a coat hanger. <clears throat> So this wall here is coming this down. This whole wall is coming down. And we'll put her closet over here. <clears throat> yeah. But and look, I think this is the dresser that's going in the bathroom. Check out the view from here. There's Let's the deck. The there you go. That's the view. <clears throat> she loves the fact that she is going to be able to lay in bed and see her burn. Yeah, she'll be she's laying in bed. Uh, yesterday, she like cracked up a few times. So she could look out there and look at the river and she could look out this window and see the barn. Back into the hallway. I'll firm me the lights as we go. There you go. And this will be the entrance to our bedroom. This is the biggest bedroom I think we have ever owned. <laughs> so this is the vestibule to the bedroom. Right. And I kind of like this dresser where it is. So and that I'm chair. I'm not going to move it. And that chair. It's a good to uh, put your... Uh, your socks on chair. Yeah, put your socks on chair. <laughs> and then the rowing machine will go here. Yeah, the rowing machine will be right there. So Oof. we'll have to get rid of that little box there. and The box will go somewhere. Yeah. Big, big cupboard for linens and blankets and stuff. Stuff that was living in the basement in big Ziploc bags but won't have to anymore. And over here we have dueling closets. Ding 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 ding. Yeah. So we're gonna put living history clothes in one. Probably and that one because it's bigger. It's bigger. And is uh, it? yeah, it is. Bye. And regular clothes in the small yeah, one. Yeah, this one here will be living histories on both ends. Yeah, all the way through. And uh, this one here and will be shelves our on the top, the which us, is nice. The the uses. So that means. This will be my part. Yeah, because you don't have any and nice this and this will be Kelly's part. Anymore. Actually, I have some some suits, suits, but, but yeah, they don't take that much room. Now let's do the the really cool effect thing there. 
This is the shot that never ends type thing. Shot that never ends. <laughs> yeah, we're not dealing with uniforms anymore. No so. more uniform. Hey, today's my last day that I'm employed. Yeah. <laughs> so this is our bedroom. Look at, check out the comfy bed. Check out that comfy bed that we will be living on until our bed arrives. Yeah. So. This is a ginormous bedroom. Yeah, this is a this is a double bed there, just by so to give you an example. So, yes, Bear owns the bed; we only borrow it. Yeah. So. So, my dresser and my makeup table will go on either side here. Big queen bed, bedside tables. Pierce dresser will go here. Yep, and again. Check out the view. Holy fuck. Look at the view over to the wards to the left there where the river bends. Yeah. I can't believe how lucky we are. <laughs> yeah, we lucked out. Yeah. We definitely lucked out. Here, let's do the, the selfie mode. The <laughs> selfie mode. Okay. Except that everything I'm a, is really... I'm, a, I'm looking a bit tired. A little tired? Well, he's got the little wrinkles thing there. But that's, you know... Puffy eyes. Yep. So, yeah, this is the tour of the house. And uh, so now I can't wait to get my stuff back. And unpack it. And and unpack it and make it home. Make it home. Yeah. yeah. But this house feels nice. It, it has good yeah. energy in it. Um... I think the, the team Afterlife picked it out for us and they've already moved in. <laughs> um, best sleep in a couple of weeks last night, except for the very hard mattress. We will be looking forward to our own bed again. <laughs> yep. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll keep you guys posted. We'll put every time there's renovations happening, every time there's, uh, you know, when the furniture comes in, I'll, uh, I'll do a little quick tour afterwards or... You show all the boxes all everywhere. The boxes like we did at the first house. And yeah. and then uh, when we do the, uh, when we start taking down walls and, you know, electricals and whatnots and yeah, we'll put all that there. Yeah. yeah. Looking forward to that. So welcome to Fitz Randolph House on the Annapolis River in Carleton County. Mm -hmm. Or Carlton Corner. Carlton Corner. Annapolis County. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get it right eventually. We'll get it right eventually. <laughs> okay, guys. Thank you for watching. And, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, if you like the video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give us a thumbs up and dingle that bell over here. <laughs> <Dang>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> on that side. So see you guys later. So here is the view from the riverbank. Okay. This is the Annapolis River. If you go that way, you go towards Greenwood. This way, you go towards the Annapolis Basin. And uh, Digby, and further out, you're in the Bay of Fundy. Uh, so if you look at that green, that green line right there, and uh, the, uh, the not so green on this side, the not so green on this side is a hay field that uh, was agreed upon uh, for uh, the local farmers to come and uh, and cut down and mow and roll up big bales well that's what they were doing that just as we were arriving on the uh, Wednesday so if you look all the way up you, you follow that one that one line so this that's the property post right here and there's another one right here so we don't have much on the waterfront but we still got you know like 30 feet or so, so anyway this is our our property line I'll go up this way here from this post so you see the demarcation and even on excuse the plastic bag so so you got that that line over here and 
further up, you see that line of uncut hay over there. The uncut stuff is ours. And then you got that telephone pole. That's, that's to the left of that is ours. You see our little mansion over there. So on this side, I'm navigating with the with bear here, so bear with me, bear with me, don't, don't. Okay, on this side, as I was uh, saying the other day, is, <clears throat> so you got that tall, tall tree, well, that tall, tall, that taller of the th uh, tree over there, well, right beside, over here, these guys, that would be the marker. I believe that's a looks like a birch from here, but I'm not sure. It, that would be the marker all the way up, and you can't see our house from here. You can see the barn, you can't see our house because of the tree there. That would be our property line, following the the ditch between the two properties. Yeah, so, very, very sad. <laughs> I can't believe we got, we got this. I can't, I really can't. This is like freaking amazing. Yeah. So I'm in my morning walk right now. It's like, uh, I don't have a watch anymore. Uh, I think it's about 6.30ish in the morning. Still a little bit overcast. Supposed to clear out today. But, uh, yeah, check out this. This is, like, from the riverbank. <laughs> I can't believe we got, we, we landed on this piece of property. So, anywho, yeah, uh, I think I'm going to put my computer up today. Just uh, one monitor and, uh, and uh, the PC itself so I could do some editing and upload this. Soon as I uh, soon as I have uh, internet, I'll upload it. So, thanks for watching. See you guys later.